what's up guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Omega Ruby walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we did our quote-unquote final side quest. You know, we went to Granite Cave, got another Mega Stone, that kind of fun stuff. And now, we're going to be getting our third badge right here. Now, off-screen, I saw that I managed to have enough money to buy at least two expensive TMs. And I did teach him to Hydra number two. So let me just show you what kind of moves it has. It actually has Dragon Tail, so that's a good move right there. And I decided to actually give Yokozuna a uh, another good move right here, which is Power Up Punch. Since its attack is through the roof, I might as well, you know, boost it up while I'm battling. Don't you think? It's it's a good move. Very, very good move. Okay, so let's go right ahead and start battling some gym leaders because, you know what? It's been a while. We need to fill up on our, on our badges and all that stuff. So here it is, the gym leader, uh, Watson, and he's like a, the cheerfully electrifying man. I don't know about that, but the most electrifying man in sports entertainment might say something. You guys know who that is. The Rock. And here we go. Yo, how is it uh, going, champ to be, Draven? Watson, the leader of the Mauville Gym, uses electric type Pokemon. If you chain or if you challenge him with water type Pokemon, he'll zap them. Bzz. And he'll and he he's put some switch controlled electric devices all over his gym. Eccentric. Eccentric. Hey, go for it. Okay, alrighty. Alright. Alright, I'm stretching. Just stretching my muscles and all that stuff. Okay, so, uh, let's see. The two Pokemon that I'm gonna be using in this one right here, maybe three is going to be Sage and Yokozuna for obvious reasons. So I'm going to go with Yokozuna first. The only problem is Yokozuna is a little slower than Electric-type Pokemon, so we're going to have to be worried about that. So here we go. My Electric Soul, it'll shatter dream your dreams whole. Wah! Alrighty. Bring it on, homeboy. So we're getting challenged by Guitar Kirk, and he will be coming out with his Magnemite. Now, this is the reason why we brought Yokozuna. Magnemites are steel type Pokemon. You know what steel type Pokemon hate? Fighting type Pokemon. Alrighty. So let's go. Power up punch. Now, make sure to bring a lot of uh, par paralysis heals here because, yeah, it it's gonna get bad. You're gonna get paralyzed up the you know hoo ha. And as you can see, Yokozuna increased its power and he's about to come out with an electric. So I'm just gonna take care of business right here with one more hit. Hopefully this electric doesn't have static. So let's go with a rock tomb now that it's powered up. And look at that. That quick claw. Let it move first and... Are you serious? What's... Okay, what's good about quick claw if you can't move first? And look at that. No more electric. So I, I, I picked the right Pokemon for this whole situation right here. As you can see, Yokozuna grows to level 25. That's a good Pokemon right there. And, uh, well, Raiden grows to level 29. And it wants to learn Thunder Fang, so let's go right ahead and take away that Spark attack. It's not that great, but Thunder Fang, that's something. That is something. So here we go, Thunder Fang for the win, and yes, we defeated Kirk, yes. Defeated him. Easily. Gattaca. Okay, so let's see, let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here. And uh, let's pick another guy right here, and uh, well, let's go ahead and move this switch, and it actually... Takes one electrical current away and get the other one going. And if you go right here, alrighty. So we're going straight forward. And uh, what the hell am I doing? Just going forward right here. And now you'll find, uh, let's see, one, two, three trainers, I guess. So let's go. Hey, this gym's got puzzles. Isn't it fun? It is. Alrighty, here we go. You are challenged by Youngster Ben, and he will be coming out with his electric. All right, you little slit. Here we go. Sage of the Halo, ready to kick some butt right now. And, uh, well, let's go straight for that Leaf Blade. Hopefully we don't get paralyzed off that first attack right there. So there we go. Leaf Blade does its damage. There goes Electrike. That's how you do it right there. Alrighty. And, uh, well, <laughs> that was easy, I guess. Oh, wow. Might have overleveled my Pokemon just a little bit. It is what it is, guys. It is what it is. And we got three trainers right here. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, battle this girl right here. And she's like, with my charm and my Pokemon's moves, you'll be shocked. Okay, maybe. I don't know. Here we go. Battle girl Vivian would like to battle. And she's coming out with her Meditite. Now, this guy may have Thunder Punch. So we got to be aware of what he does. And, uh, 
All right, Sage of the Halo. Let's go with the. Uh, you know what? Let's go with a body or fury, uh, the fury cutter. And it takes a nice chunk. Here comes that thunder punch. Man, I wish I had thunder punch, and it's not effective. Okay, alrighty. Here we go again, fury cutter. Now it's gonna get stronger here. There we go. Look at that. No more meditite. Suck on that. Alrighty. Everybody's growing levels, getting experience, and she's not happy. She's like, I'm shocked with you by your power. You should be, baby. You should be. Okay, let's move that. And, uh, okay, so this guy might have an, uh, what was it, Magnemite. So let's go right ahead and go back to Yokozuna right here. And uh, let's change this right here. So now we're going to be going straight forward for the homeboy. Let's go right here. I trained under Watson. There ain't no way I'd lose easily. Is that so? Here we go. You are challenged by guitarist Sean, and he will be coming out with his Voltorb right here. Okay. See what you're doing, Voltorb, looking all mean and Pokeballish. Let's go with Yokozuna right here, and Yokozuna, go with that vital throw. And uh, what the hell? Eerie Pulse. That's scary. And uh, that. Okay. Well, <laughs> jokes on you. We're a physical attacker. Look at that. Oh my god. There goes another Pokemon. Another one bites the dust. And Toxic Batman grows to level 25. He's coming out with another Voltorb. So let's just stay put right here. And, uh, well, let's go with another Vital Throw. Vital Throw. For the win. And, well, they're trying to lower my, my stats. That's not going to work perfectly. So let's go ahead and try this again. And that Vital Throw does the trick. But I get paralyzed, which is always a bummer crud but it faints it's still it's it's still something a win is a win is a win okay alrighty and uh, well we defeated guitarist Sean right here he's been turned off okay alrighty okay and uh, huh. <laughs> would you look at that it turns out toxic Batman loves me okay so I thought this was going to take a long time, but I guess I was wrong. Giving it a massage, putting the the, 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 the bell, the, the soothe bell on it actually worked. And uh, look at that. We got ourselves Toxic Batman Crobat. Oh, look at that. It's a pretty awesome Pokemon. It's a good Pokemon. Good stuff. I was Okay, I was surprised by that. I'm just as surprised as many of you guys right there. Okay, so what is next right here? Oh yes, we're going to be battling uh, Watson because he thinks he's all friggin' tough and everything. So, let's see. First is first. Let's heal our Pokemon. Then let's check, uh, take a look at the new Toxic Batman that we have. And then uh, after that, you know, do our thing right here. So, there we go. And uh, well, let's go straight to Toxic Batman and see what he's all about. Or, yeah, it's a he. So, it has Inner Focus, which protects it from uh, flinching. And it is a super speedy Pokemon. Very, very speedy. So, it, it very defensive, very speedy. And uh, poison and uh, poison and flying type Pokemon. It's a very good Pokemon right here. And, uh, well, as you can see, Watson is waiting for us. And, uh, well, let's see. You know what? I'm going to go with Yokozuna right here. Alright, bring it on, Watson. Look at that. He's just admiring that ball. Alrighty. He's, he, he's so happy. He looks like a Santa Claus or something. And uh, look at that. Oh! Now, what are you doing here? What? You say you got past all my rigged doors? What? <laughs> now that is amusing. The plans to reform Mauville are done now. Making traps for my gym and battling with young trainers like you are the, be are the things I live for now. Then I, Watson, the leader of the Mauville Gym, shall electrify you. Ha 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 If you smell what Watson's cooking. Okay, peace sign is thrown and everything. The gauntlet has been thrown. Okay, we're going to be battling Watson, the third gym leader for the uh, Mauville City Gym. And he will be coming out with his Magnemite. Now, one thing that really 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 pissed me off about this was when I started playing the the Hoenn region in Pokemon Sapphire they kept on kicking my butt because of Shockwave wasn't prepared until just now 
So let's go with a power-up punch. That's right. Quick Claw is working perfectly. Look at that. And oh, you you done you done messed up right now because you got the sturdy and balls. Yes, we're gonna get paralyzed right here. That's why you guys should buy a lot of paralysis heals. Let's go again and go with that vital throw. Hopefully it does not miss. And uh, yeah, homie here wants to throw a super potion. Okay, I see what you're doing. And it, god dang it, it can't move. Okay, that is what they try to do right here. And that is, oh crud. Use the Volt Switch attack, which of course will switch the Pokemon to the next Pokemon that it chooses. And uh, well, he's coming out with the Voltorb right here. All right, here we go. Power up punch. For the win, and it increases its attack just a little bit more. So now you guys are messed. You guys are messed up right here. Okay, alrighty. And, uh, well, let's see. He's going to come out with a Magnemite. So I should stick with Yokozuna right here. And, uh, well, let's go right ahead and use another Vital Throw. And, uh, really? So this might be the Yokozuna show, because this guy right here is just throwing... He's just throwing Vital or Volt Switch. And... Uh, Oh, okay, never mind. Here we go. Vital Throw does its thing. Say goodbye to Magneton. Okay. Can't destroy me. Uh-uh. I'm the greatest. Gaia number 23. Draining Kiss? What the hell? What the hell? Draining Kiss. What does this do? It's a fairy attack, and it will take 50. Okay, it drains the attack, and uh, let's see what this disarming... Oh, it never misses. Eh, well, you know what? Screw it. Let's take away Double Team, because I really don't need it. I should heal up my Pokemon. Prepare for the worst and all that stuff. And uh, let's see, he's gonna come out with a Magnemite, so let's just stick right here with a uh, good old buddy Yokozuna. Nowhere to run now, buddy. Nowhere to run. So here we go, Vital Throw, and uh, uh crud. What do you? Oh crud. Oh, of course, he's gonna be faster than us. So here we go, Vital Throw. Takes nearly takes him out, and uh, there's that sturdy. You a hole right here. Power up punch. Do the Hadouken right here, and he's trying to use the Volt Switch, but it has nowhere to run. Critical hit. Cannot move. God dang it. All right. Come on. Vital throw. Do it for all the Yokozuna bitches out there, and ooh, nearly getting thrown out right there. And there it is. Vital throw for the win. Suck it, Magnemite. And, uh, well, let's see. Level 26 Yokozuna been doing a lot for us and it is now learning belly drum which of course powers it up but at the expense of its uh, HP taking half its HP but you know what I'm just gonna take away focus energy I got other plans right here and uh, well hopefully you guys will, will love the next plans right here so there we go Yokozuna learned belly drum and uh, well Hydra number two grows to level 23 and it's learning Dragon Rage, okay, so let's go ahead and take away that splash attack now that it's an actual freaking Gyarados. An awesome Gyarados. A spectacular Gyarados. Gattaca. There we go. And, uh, well, he's like, wow, <laughs> fine, I lost! Seems, he seems really happy for losing and all that stuff, so. He's like, I was electrified by you. Now, take this badge! BAM! And again, I really do like the way they, they changed up the badges just a little bit, the aesthetic of it. And look at that, we get the Dynamo Badge from Watson. With that Dynamo Badge, Pokemon can use the HM Rock Smash outside of battle. One other thing, Pokemon up to level 40 will obey you now, even if you got them some, from someone else. Alrighty then, and he, this is for you too. Go on and take this with you. We get ourselves the TM72 Volt Switch. A very nice move. Volt Switch is a move where your Pokemon attacks the opponent and then rushes it back to the switch places with the party of the, or party Pokemon in waiting. I swell it with optimism, seeing a promising young trainer like you. Alrighty, okay. So that's three badges down, guys. And uh, what, episode 18, I think? 19? I don't even know. Now, just when you think this is the last of this whole episode right here, we still got one more thing to do. One more thing! Uncle from Jackie Chan Adventures. Uh, let's see. We're gonna be going to the Pokemon Center and we're gonna be retrieving a Pokemon right here because now that we're enabled to actually use Rock Smash, I, I figured that it's time to do it right here in this episode because we got stuff to do on the next one. So let's move, let's get Zigzags and replace it with, or replace 
uh, Yokozuna since it's already done its job right here. And, uh, okay, one more thing right here. Let's go right ahead and teach it uh, Rock Smash. Did we get Rock Smash? Yes, we did. We got Rock Smash. Heck yes. Okay. And, of course, Zigzags is a very, very reliable uh, Pokey Slave or Pokey HM Slave. So let's go ahead and uh, find a move that it can actually replace. Let's go with Tail Whip right here. Now, we will be needing Zigzags later on. Or I might be using a different Pokemon right here. Again, guys, I will be changing up my team from time to time just because... So, let's go right ahead and go straight to Verdant Turf because uh, there is a little somebody there waiting for us and, uh, yeah, we need to take care of business. Need to take care of business. And, uh, well, somebody's, uh, saying hello to us, but we're not gonna be capturing them. Now, we need to, we need to take care of a little something right here, too. Let's see, um, so after you beat three badges, you can actually get the Ultra Ball, which is good, too. That's actually very beneficial for us. And I'm going to be buying a few repels because, yeah, I don't want to be attacked by any kind of Whismers right here. So let's go and uh, let's go and take care of business right here. Let's go. Let's go. Right here. Okay. Let's see. Um, first and foremost, let's get that repel on us. Let's see. Where are you? Where are you, big-ass repelled? There you are. Okay, there we go. You are repelled. And uh, now, let's go straight ahead and uh, take care of business right here. Because these lovebirds have been waiting for quite some time. I want to do something about this boulder, but... It's beyond me to deal with it duh, alone! Question, or exclamation point. Y your Pokemon! It can use Rock Smash! Please, use Rock Smash and break up these boulders! Sure, why not? Thank you so much for doing this! Judo chop! That's right. I am that strong. Wow! You shattered those boulders blocking the way! To show you how much I appreciate it, I'd like you to have this. The Agron Knight! I didn't realize it, but this is going to be part of my, you know... <laughs> this is going to be part of my, uh, my, uh... Where to find, uh... Where to find my witch, I'm gonna call it, uh... Mega Stones. Yeah. So... That will be part of the Megastone thing right there. So, yes, we found that, and uh, we'll put the Agronite away. I found that when I was digging down in the tunnel, I felt like there's something mysterious power coming from it, but I don't think I could uh, I could do a thing with it. Wanda, now I see you, uh, and now I can see you anytime. That, that's wonderful. Come on, let me, uh, let me take you to my place so you can, uh, you can rest. Oh yeah, you know what that means, guys. You guys know what that means. They're gonna go eat. Because I'm hungry too. Alright, so, uh, yeah. That was pretty much it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, we defeated the gym leader easily and all that stuff. And uh, now, we are going to be going on another side quest. Because now that we defeated uh, Watson, we are unable to go into the next phase of the... What was it? The Trick House. So, stay tuned, guys. The next episode will be the Trick House. If not, then we're gonna be doing something else. I don't know. Whatever. See you guys.